Sustina for Black Badgers. In this lecture hall, there are only two students made of tar. I am one, listening to the scream of chalk. I am one in the stomach of silence as it shakes from hunger. We all so packed in with the feeling of stillness, I question if this some type of ship. I think what spell of protection they got, what magic that they can be all badger red and not see a sea of blood. The basketball game lets out and we kept our silence on the lawn to dry the bleed. I am not there, but my friend calls after. The sh says the shock stuck her feet to the grass like tar. Says it could have been the boy in her physics class yell. Should have followed the rules. Easy as magic to bring the future boys back and wash away their soon to be drawn out lines of chalk. When you see him in class, ask him the best way to stay alive since they are experts in all. The best way to not be shipped from here to God so quickly, I swear. America is looking for a buffet of black bodies. Never met a woman so hungry. Madison was voted the most liberal city in America, but it is here that I learned of thirst and hunger. We ain't like Ferguson. No, why give a whole street to a black boy when he can paint a cage with blood and they can call it justice. I saw the boat crash through the road and unload more bodies from the ship. I couldn't see them fall into the cells like unnamed tar, but I know they did once the siren silence. What an awful, awful day to chalk a rebellion on the stone when all it does is rain and the city is clean again like magic. A girl in my class states that the lack of indictments has nothing to do with race. Race is all a magic trick. I think of all the brown ears listening for each 28 hour mark, each feeding time for Miss Liberty's hunger. My professor asked us to write our, the first thoughts that come to mind. I grab the chalk and put breath on the board. That night when the sun goes down, a blood orange, I count off another day of survival and listen for the cannon. The tar road is covered in snow and I am grateful to stand out if I end up on the ground today. My heart calls to my ancestors to ask how to stay alive among so many bodies on the city ship. For the secrets of holding on to breath when death is a chokehold away. What kind of black magic must I be made of here? Even while walking soundlessly, I am a goddess of tar that attracts moon men. I don't want to belong to the street, so I feed the questions hunger that are always about the riots and never about the blood. The concrete is clean today, but the clouds look like God drew them in chalk. Which angels took their last beds of chalk with them? I watch them move and imagine it is the ship till sails when I hear the whistle of wind. Can't see no blood up there unless I catch the sun mid-bow. And if that ain't no magic trick to die with us daily and come back to watch again. If that ain't the hunger of the earth, it's mouth so full of tar, I don't know what is. Nah, this ain't no magic. This is a country with a belly of bodies feigning hunger. I'm a student in a landfill filled to the brim with tar.